Raiders Ram EA Sports as we get late in the season, getting week 13 kicked off. Hello, friends. Jim Nance along with Bill Sims. And we're about to go live with our game matchup. It's an important game in some respects. No, the playoffs aren't going to happen in this case. But there's always that storyline about trying to build for next year and a little respect. How do you see it, Bill? I think, boy, of course this is a crucial game, Jim. And here's what I say to the players and the coaches. Don't go out there and play not to lose. Go out there to win the game. Take some chances. Be aggressive. The one that's aggressive, willing to take chances, I think that's the team that's going to come out on top here today. The Rams ready here for the... <laughs> Moore is going to run this one out. Gets out past the 20 and brought down at the 24. Cards coming on to the field now, having found his mark last week on over 50% of his throws. They come to the line, and it's first down. They better hurry to get the snap. Murray's going to secure the handoff. And he's tackled at the 30-yard line. Hard to judge sometimes what time of possession really means in an NFL game. But I know this. When you run the football like that and you pick up decent yards, that's a good thing for the offensive side and a great thing for your football team. Second down coming up. That's a delay of game. Second and nine now, following the penalty on the offense. Handoff made. The game may be five. And now a look at the Raiders offense, hoping for a reversal of fortune as this offense has not kicked it in the gear all year long. One of the lowest scoring teams in the league. Third down now. They need to get the playoff. Play fake. Throws to the right. Could have been intercepted. Whoa, the quarterback took a big sigh of relief after that throw. That pass was close. It was nearly picked off. And sometimes you just gotta, gotta make a better decision at the quarterback position.
King is back now. He'll be punting. Trying to beat the play clock. No return here as he makes the fair catch. Bradford's trotting out to the huddle. His completion percentage was well below 50% last week, so he'll look to improve on that part today. Britt's going to get set in the Three, slot for this snap. Two, First down at the 17. Bradford's able to fake into the line and still has it. Makes the catch, but didn't get the feet down. Incomplete. Here's a look at the Rams' offense. They've shown this season they're not a team that's going to run the ball very much. After the incomplete pass, it brings up second down. It's an empty backfield for Bradford this time. He'll stand back beyond the center in the gun. Makes the catch. He'll be taken down about three yards short of the first. Graham, a lot of people like to throw screens and run draws. No, they look deep down the field. It's not there. They throw it short. They pick up some good yards. Now they can do what they want on third, run or pass. The Rams want to convert here, especially after last week's abysmal performance in third down situations. Mason lined up in the backfield. He'll fire it out to the left, underneath, but can't find the mark that time as the pass goes incomplete. The Rams call on their punting team. Moore's got it at the 25. Picks up about five. First down on the way. They send the tight end in motion. They'll run it here. Looking for space. Left side for a gain of about five. And now here's the Rams defense. A defense that's been a porous defense when it comes to stopping the run. They have got to figure out a way to stop the running attack. Second down after... Going to the ground game, the first play. Offense lines up here. And off the mark on that short throw. Well, your teammates are really going to respect you after something like this. Anytime you're on that field as an athlete, and when you give all your effort to every single play like that time, how about that? Just giving every bit of effort he can to make the catch, not able to get it, what a job of him. Cars lined up. Two tight end set. Third and five. Brings it in. The tackle is made at the 40-yard line. Boy, he hung in there that time, Phil. Took the hit and still completed the pass. Ooh, that was a big hit. I'll give him a lot of credit. That's a nice job. But when you get hit like this as a quarterback down the line, it's going to affect how you play. You're going to start getting rid of the football a little quicker, and you might miss some opportunities. Quarterbacks love to see a receiver uh, have this type of play. Even though he doesn't make the catch, his effort is outstanding, and he's given everything he has to make that catch. That's second down coming up. The Raiders will take the snap from the 40. Murray's going to take the handoff now. 
Good piece of tackling. that run third and eight for the offense on this passing down the defense comes out in the nickel play action fake looking to throw and looking underneath this will go incomplete on third downs the defense goes in most situations it's going to be a pass and let's give some credit to the defensive front they pressure the QB and they force the incompletion Touchback now as the ball comes out to the 20. They come to the line of scrimmage, first down. Sam Bradford will be under center. Mason's got it on the handoff. Gains five. And now here's the Raiders defense. Last week, this group came up with three forced turnovers. And it's now second down and five after running it on first down. Bradford standing back in the shotgun ready for the snap. Kenny Britt pulls it in. Brought down at the 38. In this league now, you've got to keep these wide receivers and quarterbacks guessing. You just can't come out there and play man-to-man -man every play and think that's going to work. You've got to mix in some zones, some blitzes, and then occasionally go man-to-man -man coverage. The Raiders defense brings in an extra member of the secondary. He'll go nickel. And that's a gain of maybe five. Good job that time by the offense. Power run gets him a few yards. Second down here after that run play. Offense lines up here. Here we go. Blue 45. Move for the five. Bradford's going to take the snap from the shotgun. Williams. Now they take the football onto the opponent's side of the field. When you play zone in the NFL, what you're trying to do is make the quarterback hold the football just for a half a second longer, and you hope the pass rush can get there. They don't that time. That's why he got the completion. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. Brits in the slot. Here we go now. Come on. They're setting up screen. Keeps turning ahead. Games 17. Jim, this time it's a halfback screen. Nice job by the quarterback. The halfback. Good job after catching it. Picked up some good yards. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. The Rams line up, split backfield. Ready. A sloppy five-yard penalty on the false start. False start. Offense. They face first down. Mason's taking the handoff. In on the stop. 
Always good to have these types of runs. Yeah, it's not a first down, but it sends a message. It shows everybody that you can run it when you want to. And also, it opens up so many other things for your offense. The defense comes out in the nickel. The Rams from the 27. Mason's hand of the football. Now third and five after the run. Brits, a receiver in the slot. Bradford's back in shotgun formation. Kenny Britt pulls it in. Tackle's made, and the first down is picked up. Well, when you keep chipping away with these short throws, sooner or later, that defense is going to come up, and when they come up, that's when you throw it over the top. He'll take the snap from the gun. Catch made. Bailey's marked down after a gain of nine. The Rams had a nice play designed that time and pulled the defense, and they get the pass completion for a nice pickup. About to snap it for the ninth play of the drive. The defense comes Green, out of the dime. Takes it from the eye. The Rams now move the chains. They keep fighting for every inch, every yard, as they move closer and closer to the end zone. Well, this offense, they fit perfectly with the head coach. He's a tough guy. He's a grinder. And this offense, what a job here right now. They are grinding this football, like you said, right down the field. First down here after the run. Mounting a serious drive. He'll throw it over the middle. Has it. Touchdown. Well, it's first to go. I think a lot of defense is a thinking run here. And so the offense, they call. Accepted. They throw the football and they get the easy touchdown pass. The Rams now will tack on the extra point. Driving extra point is good. Bradford certainly given his team some momentum with that scoring drive. He just put together a possession where he threw for more than 60 yards. Rams ready to boot the football down the field. That's a touchback, and the ball will be spotted at the 20. It's first down as they head to the line. And Holmes is lined up now as a slot receiver. The Raiders will use a timeout here. They'll talk it over. down here offense lines up here Murray's going to secure the handoff he's brought down at the 20 yard line after being stopped at the line of scrimmage it's now second down and 10 Offense lines up here. Throws the pass. And Laurinaitis, the one who brings him to the ground. Well, they talk about it's a third down lead. You got to pick up third downs to, to have success and win football games. Good play call, good pass, good catch. Now it's third and short. I like the offense's chances. Play clock's running down. And in 
incomplete. The defense does his job forcing fourth down in a hurry. The Raiders will second guess that play call. That time on third short, they throw the football. Everybody thought they were going to run it. They were trying to be too clever, and it backfired. Now it's fourth down. Signals, fair catch. First down here. Oh, Sam Bradford will be under center. Mason's going to take the handoff now. Mason's never able to build up that power that he has as a running back when there's nowhere to go. Hey, there's nowhere to go. That's a short game. The Rams right now are returning the favor in this game. They were beaten up badly last week, and now they've turned it around, and they've just cruised to this point, Phil. Yeah, they've done a good job, Jim, of what they've done. They just said, to heck with it. Let's go out there and fight. And that's what you have to do in the NFL to win. They are fighting hard. Let's see if they can pull this one out. Offense. After that penalty, it's now second and 14. Wide receivers are bunched up. Ready, three, 90, three, 90. Bradford's got it in the gun. Pulls it in. They bring him to the turf. All the quarterbacks in the NFL, they'd all be great if they had all day to throw like this. When you give an average quarterback this kind of time, he turns into a great quarterback. After that last reception, they are still eight yards away from a first. Third and eight coming up. Bradford's going to take it from the gun. Eyeing that left side. Kenny Britt pulls it in. And he is brought down at the 39. We're through one quarter, and we'll take a short break as you're watching the NFL on EA Sports. The NFL on EA Sports is brought to you by Verizon never be without football and Williams is lined up in the slot go. and the second quarter is underway with this snap to Williams should have had it well it's tough when you're a quarterback or a coach and you see a receiver drop the pass because we know it's hard it's hard to get open in the NFL but don't get down uh, you're not the game is not perfect Find a way to get the football back to that guy so he can make the catch and get going again. The Rams have it at the 39. The defense gets a sack. There is nothing worse for a quarterback than have the pocket collapse. And that time they collapsed on his left side. There's nothing he can do. And he goes down for the sack. Third down. Split backfield here. Bradford standing back in the shotgun, ready for the snap. He's looking to the right here on this throw. Jim, when you get in these situations, there's not much you can do. Third long, not easy to pick up first downs in these type of situations. Hecker is back now. He'll be punting. Muffs it. The ball's on the ground. That returner, when he goes to the sideline, I promise you, that special teams coach is going to rip him a new one. Hold on to the football. Lucky to get it back after that fumble. Tight end in motion. First and ten. Murray's got it on the handle. He stacked up at that point. Running backs. They love counter runs. They know when a defense has been over pursuing, 
So they make that fake one way, and when they cut it back, there's usually a great running lane there. Offense lines up here. Second down and five. Gets it out for the completion. Tackle's made, and that'll move the chains. Number four. Zone defense doesn't work in the NFL like it used to. Good job by the quarterback reading that zone and finding the open guy. First down here after the completion. Nickel formation here for the defense. Murray's taking the handoff. Donald's able to read that play and make the hit. Good job by the defense. They stopped the first down play that time by the offense, and now they have a good situation. Nickel formation for the defense here. The Raiders have it at the 24. He's got the catch. And they advance the ball onto the other side of the field. Carr selling this play big time. The defense, they go for the run fake, and that's why he has time to throw the football and makes the completion. Good job. Let's see what they do on first down following that huge play. Aaron's all over the ball carrier. They went with the ground game on first down, bringing up second. Offense lines up here. Takes it again. And there's only two yards to be found right there. The Raiders trailing this one, and the running game has not been an asset. Murray's had a really hard time of it, and right now his team, with it behind, knows they have to get him to step up. Well, they do. You want your running back to step up. You see a running game struggle like we have seen so far here today, Jim. It always comes down to this. The offensive line is getting dominated, so there's no chance for the running back to get anything done. The offensive line, they've got to change up. The Raiders getting set now to try to put three on the board. Puts it through the uprights. Needed plenty of leg on that one. Well, I'm sure the defense is going, my gosh, what do we got to do to stop these guys? You know, once they even get near midfield, they know that the other team is in field goal range because that kicker, what a leg. The Rams are ready to return the kick. Fields the football at the three. And the tackle's made right around the 26-yard line. First down coming up. For this play, they'll go with two tight ends. They'll run it. Here's the handoff. Tackle by top. Second down now. Williams going to get in the slot for this snap. Mason's handed the football. Now cutting to the right side, looking for some open space. After that last run, it sets up third and six. Sam Bradford backing off the line of scrimmage and into the shotgun. Dropping back now into the shotgun. The pass doesn't find a mark.
The punter awaits the snap. Moore's going to take this one from the 18. He'll pick up seven this time. First down, offense readying for the snap. Murray's lined up as the single back. Takes the snap. We're about midway, second quarter. When you play zone coverage, the quarterback might have to hold the football just a little longer. But these guys nowadays, when you play zone, they know how to throw and catch and get it done. Second down, four to go. Looks to his left. Reaches out and snatches it. That'll stop the play right there. Now to be a running back in the NFL, you got to do more than one thing, and you got to be part of the pass game. That was a wonderful job. Catching the short pass and picking up all those extra yards. in motion here. Play clock's running down. Murray's going to secure the handoff. Slashing to the right side. Jenkins is there to take him down. Hey, this defense, they are tough. When you run that football, they got some men up front. And that time, they stopped that run just for a short game. And here we have second down. It's Ogletree there to meet him. Number four. Well, that was a nice job by the offense. It just puts him in a better position. Nice little throw and catch. It'll be third down. To the left brings it into his body and he's going to be tackled and that's going to bring us to fourth down that's a face mask call and of course for now on it's 15 yards no matter how you slice it they don't even have to interpret it anymore the severity of it it's a big penalty yeah it is a big penalty uh, you know one thing you know why we see a lot of face mask penalties in the nfl now it's because players tackle too high get your arms around the waist go down low to make those tackles and you wouldn't get those face mask penalties they come to the line and it's first down They better hurry to get the snap. Reese is going to take the handoff now. being stuffed at the line of scrimmage. It's now second down and 10. They bring in the extra tight end. That's dropped by Jones, who couldn't bring it in. You don't see it often in today's game. These gloves, these wide receivers wear, my gosh, anybody can catch it. I don't know how he dropped it.
Following that incompletion, it sets up third and 10. Maurice Jones-Drew lined up in the backfield. Jones has got the catch and the first. You can do all you want on the defensive side. You can give a lot of looks, but it's just too easy for the quarterbacks and receivers to throw a catch. Double tight end formation. Staying with the passing game on first down. Has Jones. And it's James Laurinaitis in on the tackle. Crossing routes. That's what you want to Type of coverage. Four deep. Cover four. Look for guys going across the field. Hard for the defense to cover those throws. They'll take the snap from inside the red zone. A week ago, they had a lot of success inside the 20. From the gun. Cars pass will go for an incompletion this time. Nice job that time by the defense. Pressure on the quarterback. He does not have time to find an open guy, and it results in an incompletion. This is third down. Marching down the field and taking their time. They need to get the playoff. Offense a little too slow getting set at the line on that one. Third down after the penalty. Play after play after play here on this drive. From the gun. Looking across the middle, and this will go incomplete. Got a hand on the pass and knocked it away. Good job by the linebacker that time. Saw the receiver coming in his area. Read the quarterback and in wonderful position to knock the pass down. Time is coming up, but first we reach the two-minute warning. Sebastian Janikowski lining up for the kickoff. They'll take it at the 20. The Rams offense now marches onto the field. Brits in the slot. Out of the gun. And he's forced to the ground. Uh, not a good job by the quarterback that time. Inside of two minutes in the first half, you got to get rid of the football. If nobody's open, just throw it away. That time, he loses yard by taking the sack. Second down here. Mason lined up in the backfield. Hand off. The tackle was made. Power running. A lot of teams in this league don't even do it anymore. This team, they can power it up in there and pick up those tough yards. Third down, following the run. Sam Bradford will be under center. Mason's got it on the handoff. And that's a gain of 10. The Rams signal for a timeout. They have two remaining. They're able to move the chains after that last run. Bailey's a receiver in the slot. Snap it out of the gun. Trying to work that left side. Catch made near the sideline. 
Well, I guess the only good thing you can say about that play, the quarterback's happy. He gets a completion, but it only goes for a couple yards. Coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. We'll switch sides and take a break as the first half comes to a close here at the Gateway to the West. St. Louis back for the third quarter in just a few moments. And no return this time as he takes a knee. The Rams come onto the field now for this next series. Williams lined up now as a slot receiver. Three, Second half gets rolling now as he takes the snap. They'll mark him at the 28. Well, when you throw in the slant route, it's all about accuracy from the quarterback standpoint. Make sure you put it right on the receiver where he can catch it, protect himself. Good job that time and almost gets a first down. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. Second down, two to go. The Rams get a first down, and he's tackled, but not until he picked up the first down. The Rams continue to try to find something that works in the passing game. Bradford's had to deal with another rough outing. Yeah, it's been rough. Listen, the play calls are definitely not helping him out, and I'll give the defense a little credit. They've been sharp today. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. Oh. Sam Bradford will be under center. Mason's taking the handoff off the left side. He's brought down. The Rams have not been able to get the running game going these past two games, Phil. Mason's having another tough outing, and it's something that's certainly affecting the entire offense. Oh, well, sure it's affecting the offense when you're getting overpowered. Listen, this offense likes to run the football. They need to adjust. They got to find a different way to get it done. Second down following the run. Mason lined up in the backfield. Move 45. Move 45. Drop back. Shotgun formation. He'll throw it over the middle. No room to complete that one. Too much pressure on the quarterback on that play, Phil. Oh, that defense, boy, oh boy, are they aggressive, and they can get after the quarterback. We saw it on that play. This is going to be a tough assignment for this offensive line today. That last pass incomplete, and it brings up third down. Cooks playing out of position in the backfield here. Bradford's going to take the snap from the shotgun. Justin Tuck has a sack. Well, the defense has got to be excited. Anytime on third down they make the play, uh, they get pretty fired up. But when you sack a quarterback on third down, that is one happy and emotional defense right now. The Rams call on their punting team. That's a touchback, and the ball will be spotted at the 20. down on the way. Murray's lined up now as the running back behind the quarterback. Now first and ten. Has a catch for the first. Raiders, good job that time, moving the chains, picking up that first down. And, Jim, of course, there's no time to panic in a situation like this. I think they know that. It's in the second half. You got, you're got you down just a few points. 
Just keep looking for ways to get another first down, and that'll serve your team well. And now on first down, they'll go back to the air. Throws it toward the sideline, and what a catch. Well, if you want to exploit cover three, then you better be ready to throw the football to the sidelines. Well, my man is not afraid, and that was a good throw. It's a two tight end formation. Looking to go up top again on first down. And incomplete. He was double covered that time. This will be second down. Carr comes out in the pistol. Murray's handed the football. He's taken down at the 47. And it's third and ten here after the run. Cars back in shotgun formation. Almost intercepted that time. Well, Jim, I threw a lot of passes like that in my career where it should have been intercepted, and the guy dropped it, you just go, yes, I got a break. Now can you capitalize on that break? That'll be a touchback, and the ball will be placed at the 20. The Rams getting ready now to start their drive. Sam Bradford will be under center. First down and 10. Mason's going to secure the handoff. Back that time, in on the tackle. Good job of the defensive line standing in there and fighting, and they hold the running back to a short game. Two tight ends on the field here. Gets the handle here. He's tackled beyond the markers. It's a first down. Well, the defense, they give up a first down there. They're behind. They just can't sit back there and keep bending. You got to take some chances, go on the offensive, on the defensive side, and just make things happen. New set of downs now after picking up the first on the ground. Mason's in the backfield. Single back set. And incomplete. That leads us to second down. They come out in the dime package. Did not get both feet down. That was an incomplete pass that time against cover two, the two deep safeties. And you really want to throw the football down the middle or deep down the sidelines. That time the quarterback didn't do that, and that's why it was incomplete. Wide receivers stacked up on this play. Bradford's got it in the gun. Throw to the left. Thrown incomplete. They're set to punt it away now. This will bounce into the end zone for a touchback, and the ball will come out to the 20. Raiders are set for their next possession. First down at the 20. 
throws the pass. Catch made. That picks up seven. That's a nice route on the outside. Nice throw by the quarterback. Puts him in good position to keep moving and get a first down. The Raiders from the 27. Reese is going to take the handoff now. Big first down by the offense that time. Here in the second half, they're losing a close game, and you get that first down. It just gives you confidence. It opens up the playbook, and it just gives you a better chance of going down the field and getting the score. First and ten. He's got the catch, and that's a gain of nine. Anytime you get over four yards on first down, it doesn't matter what the play is. Is it a run or a pass? That time, nice throw by the QB. Now they're in great position. Second down and short. The Raiders snap it at the 41. Looking for some daylight up the middle. Well, I think we all know the situation here. It's a close game in the second half, and you're losing. But you pick up a first down. Oh, my gosh. That opens up many more possibilities. What you can do on the offensive side. Good job. Intercepted. He's brought to a halt. Good job that time by the defense. Not being fooled. Being in position. When you're in position, you have a chance to make the play. That time they did. They got the interception. They come to the line of scrimmage. First down. An extra tight end on the field for this one. Mason's got it on the handball. He's brought down right around the 43-yard line. After being stuffed at the line of scrimmage, it's now second down and 10. Keeps it here. Throwing now to his left. That'll put them in what we call plus territory. That's awesome. Every time you pick up a first down, what does that do? It shortens the game and also keeps your defense on the sideline, and they get the get rested up and ready for their turn. But you got a lead here. It's a small one in the second half. Keep getting those first downs. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. Williams is lined up in the slot. Ready, green, 90. <laughs> Mason's taking the handoff. Tucks there to make the stop. After running it, it's second down. Ready, and Williams Bree, is going to get set Bree, in the Bree. slot for this snap. Foster offense. After being stopped at the line of scrimmage, it's now second down and ten. Brits in the slot. Ready, A sack. Bradford's in a whole lot of pain right now. We'll take an injury timeout and be back in just a moment. And welcome back. Danielle Bellini is working on getting us an update on the injury as we return to action. Offense lines up here. The Rams take it from the 43. Incomplete. 
defense has ruled today's game, Phil. Yeah, the defense is dominating, and I'm going to be honest, it's fun to watch. Every once in a while, I like to see the offense take a beating. To this, The NFL, it's all about the offense. It's nice to see the defense dominate. No return here. This will be coming out to the 20. They face first down. Finds his mark. James Laurinaitis brings him down. Looking at the passing numbers on both sides of the ball, they're just not there. The coverage has been good and has been hard to move the ball against those secondaries. Yeah, good job for the defense today. They got a good pass rush going. The coverage has been good down the field. And also, the defense has been good, but the quarterback has not been real sharp. Finds his mark. Gains 11. Raiders did a good job that time picking up the first down. Let's look at the situation. You're behind just by a few points in the second half. You keep looking to pick up those first downs, and you know you get enough of them. What does it do? Pretty simple. It leads to a score. They're going back up top, and he's taken down. That's what you call pressure. When everything around the quarterback, they're all at his feet, the offense around him. He sees the arms of the defensive linemen all reaching for him. There's nothing he can do but fall to the ground. The Raiders will take the snap from the 30. Looking across the middle. Nice tackle. The quarterback that time realized it was zone coverage. He just waited for the defense to get out of position, and he threw it to the open hole. The completion sets them up now for third and seven. On this passing down, the defense comes out in the nickel. Trying to beat the play clock. Keeps it here. Looks but can't connect on the short throw. Well, quarterbacks go on third down. They got to make a decision and get rid of that football because the defense, they are coming after you. That time, just not good enough, and he throws an incompletion. as the third quarter comes to a close here in St. Louis. Not a whole lot of scoring here as we welcome you back to the action. It's first down as they head to the line. He's setting up here. He's been sacked four times already. What a beating it has been for the quarterback. And it's Roach there to meet him. You see the matchup at running back, and while only one side has really been able to count on that run game, it's still a very close game. Yeah, it is, Jim. Close game here, and also that can happen when you talk about run games. They're going to go up and down. And if you're having trouble running the football, then change the direction of your offense. Do something else. Mason's handed the football. That's a gain of six. And now they'll try over again on second down. Williams, a receiver in the slot. Bradford's going to take it from the gun. It was right there, but he didn't bring it in. Looking ahead, the Rams will be on the road in Washington next week, while the Raiders will be playing at home next week. After the incompletion, third and four coming up. 
He's setting up here. He's been sacked four times already. What a beating it has been for the quarterback. And no one is going to catch this one as it goes out of bounds. Number eight goes All set to punt here. Offense heads on to the field. They send the tight end in motion. First and ten will go ground. He's taken down at the 23. The Rams lead right now, and you look at how they played against the run today, and you have to see that this is a big factor why, Phil. Yeah, they've done everything right to stop the running game, Jim. What have they done? They've shown a lot of toughness. They have good speed on the defensive side. They're aggressive. But most of all, they've shown tremendous discipline. The play clock's running down. He hauls it in, and he is tackled at the 44. The Raiders look pretty confident out there on the field, don't they? And they're, they're very calm, and they should be. That first down, they're right in this game. Down a couple points here in the second half. Don't look down the field for that big play. Just keep marching. First down here after the completion. First down, following the long play. Back to the air here on first down. Carr's pass will go for an incompletion. Well, the quarterback can't get him open. He threw to the right guy that time, but the coverage was so good by the defense, uh, nowhere to get the completion. For this play, they'll go with two tight ends. Second down and 10. Carr's unable to find his target that time. That's what you expect in the NFL nowadays from the players, especially these receivers. They're so aggressive, so athletic. They go all out for every catch. That time, he just lets it all go. Not able to make the catch, but I'll give him an A for effort. After the incomplete pass, it's third down. The defense comes out in the nickel. Here's the handoff to Maurice Jones-Drew. He's tackled beyond the markers. It's a first down. First down here after the run. Maurice Jones-Drew. That's Quinn making the stop. That last running play was good for only a yard, so it's second down and nine. The Rams lead right now, but of course a big reason why is that defense has shown up to play. Jim, to win in the NFL, you have to do all three phases of the game the right way. Offense, special teams, and that defense must show up every single week. Good job so far here today. Third and 11. He'll throw it over the middle. With two hands, he has it. Big first down by the offense that time. Here in the second half, they're losing a close game, and you get that first down. It just gives you confidence. It opens up the playbook, and it just gives you a better chance of going down the field and getting the score. Murray's lined up in a single back formation. Play clock's running down, staying with the passing game on first down. Tackles made. You see the offensive totals for these teams, and it's been about two teams getting it done in different ways. What we're seeing is two different philosophies on the offensive side from these teams here today, Jim, and it doesn't matter. All you want to do is just get it done. Tight end in motion. First down at the 21. Murray's going to secure the handoff, and that's enough for a first down. Well, I think we all know the situation here. It's a close game in the second half, and you're losing, but you pick up a first down. Oh, my gosh, that opens up many more possibilities 
what you can do on the offensive Ready, side. Five, Good job eight, by the offense. Five, and First and goal. Throws it in the end zone. Touchdown. Touchdown, Raiders. Well, the offensive line did it all on this drive, didn't they? Here it is on first and goal. Nice job of pass blocking, and the quarterback finds the open receiver for the touchdown. All right, here we go. Red 18. Red 18. Zebra. Zebra. Throws the pass. So put down a touchdown and a two-point conversion on that occasion. Yeah, good job by the offense. He executed the play perfectly, and they got in the end zone, like you said, and got that two points. He's not going to test the coverage this time. It'll come out to the 20. The Rams come on to the field for their next series. He's setting up here. He's been sacked four times already. What a beating it has been for the quarterback. Now first and ten. Easy catch there. No one near him. Rams just picked up a big first down that time, Jim. When you're down by a few points in the second half, every first down is crucial. Nice job that time by the offense. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. Masons a running back normally, but this time go, lined up as a receiver in the slot. From the shotgun to Williams. Tackle down right around the 47. I think the best thing to say about that play, it's just a, it gained a few yards, so... That's what you do. All plays don't score. Sometimes you just want to pick up a couple yards. The pass play was good for five. Second and five coming up. Here Sam Bradford now. will Move be under five. center. Move for five. Play fake. Great pass, great catch, great control. Rams, good job that time, moving the chains, picking up that first down. And Jim, of course, there's no time to panic in a situation like this. I think they know that. It's in the second half. You've got, you're, you're down just a few points. Just keep looking for ways to get another first down, and that'll serve your team well. Mason's a running back, but he's in the slot there for this go, play. Now. Green, 90. Green, ace, ace. From the shotgun. Bradford has a completion with Jared Cook. And he's going to be tackled right around the 35-yard line. Big first down by the offense that time. Here in the second half, they're losing a close game. And you get that first down, it just gives you confidence. It opens up the playbook, and it just gives you a better chance of going down the field and getting the score. They'll hike it to him out of the shotgun. He'll fire it out to the left. Got the completion. Taken down at the 27. Well, the drag route that time picked up solid yards. These receivers, sometimes they get a little nervous running these drag routes or these short crossers because they are afraid so a defender's going to come out of nowhere and hit them. That's the quarterback's job. See in front of the receiver, lead the guy to the open space. He's got a wide open alley. Picks up eight here. The Rams continue to trail even as they continue to run the football with great success. Mason's putting up some monster numbers even in a losing cause. Yeah, this defense, they have no answers for this run game today, Jim. They have tried everything. Blitzing, crowding the line of scrimmage. Nothing is working. The one thing that is working, though, no. touchdown, Rams.
Good job by the offense. They get in there. They tie this game up. Now we'll see if the defense can take advantage of that momentum and keep it on their side. The Rams lined up for the extra point. It's good. Bradford's going to watch his defense come out here in a moment. He was good for over 70 passing yards on that last touchdown drive. to about the 27 before he's taken down. First down here. Tight ends in motion here. Murray's going to take the handoff now. That tackle was made at the 27-yard line. Jim, this defensive end is so athletic. Well, it, it measures up to you because you're an athletic guy. He holds his position, stops the runner for no gain. Great job. Coming up, second down. They bring in the extra tight end. Got a hand on it. No force, the incompletion. Oh, good job by the linebacker knocking that pass down that time. All he did was watch the eyes of the quarterback, and it reacted. It put him in good position, and he knocks the football down. and nine underneath but can't find the mark that time as the pass goes incomplete bad job that time by the quarterback he misses the receiver on the slant route when you're throwing the slant route you got to throw it right into the stomach of the receiver so it's easy for him to make the catch and he can protect himself also They're in punting formation. They better hurry to get the snap. Mason's got it at the 23. Brought down at the 32. <laughs> First down here. Three, Offense lines three, up no, here. No, no. He'll keep it on the play fake. Williams, that's a gain of eight. Looking at this comparison, Phil, it's fun to see these two quarterbacks going head to head in a tightly contested game. Yeah, so well played on the offensive side by both teams. The quarterbacks, they've been very sharp. They're on target with the football, and their offensive lines are playing very well. Time is running out. The game is tied, and the defense must do whatever it can to not give up a score. Foster, offense. Second down. The game is tied, and time is a factor for about four. When you run the football like this and you show toughness, there is no doubt when you fake it and try to throw the football down the field, the quarterback's going to have all day to get it done. Last play before the two-minute warning. Third down and three. It's the old counter play. The Rams have had a great rushing attack all game, Phil. Mason's been leading the charge on this front, Phil. And they've done it many ways. They've done it with power runs, going outside, going inside, draw plays. Everything is working for this running game today, and it's been impressive to watch. They'll take it at 
the 20. The offense comes onto the field after the punt. They can steer this game towards overtime, or they can gamble a little bit and go for the win. Jim, I would not gamble in a situation like this. You have all the control on the offensive side, play it safe, and you hope somebody breaks a play to get that offense going. Then you can gamble and try to go for the score. Murray's got it on the handoff. They'll mark the football at the 22. Second down after going to the ground game, the first play. Looking across the middle, interception. And he's brought to the ground. Laurinaitis is able to show off those great hands and picking off that pass from the linebacker position. What a job and what a pair of hands. Double tight end formation. First down and 10. Mason's taking the handoff and a gain of four. Teams in the NFL spend about 30, 40 percent of their time all week long practicing plays in the red zone. So there's a lot they can do here. Let's see if they come up with something that works. Second down and five. Picks up about two. The Raiders will, of course, call the timeout now to stop the clock. The defense looking for one more stop here on third down after that run. Here Sam go, Bradford three, will be nine, under center. Five. They call his name again. The Raiders in a tie game will call a timeout. They clearly want the ball back with a chance to do something. The Rams return to the huddle. They've gotten into field goal range in this tie game, so they know they're in control right now. The Rams can go ahead here in the fourth with this field goal. Got a flag down here. offense. The Rams in a good position now inside the red zone. They're in control of this outcome right now. The Rams now with a chance to go ahead here in the fourth with this field goal attempt. And converts on the three. They were thinking touchdown that entire drive, but in the end, they have to go field goal. They convert here in the closing stages. Well, I'm sure they would have loved to kick that field goal as time expired, but that's not the case. Good job of moving the football down the field, getting that field goal to put up ahead, and now the defense, go out there and do your job. The Raiders ready to return the kickoff. And no return as this goes for a touchback. First down. Let's see what they come up with here. Carr comes out in the pistol. First down at the 20. The Raiders now move the chains. The Raiders come to the line of scrimmage in the fourth quarter and out of timeouts. First and 10. Has his man. Side and just nothing there as Ogletree is a massive presence and makes the tackle. Has his man. That brings the play to an end. Coming up, third down. A huge moment. Going to the hurry up. Under a minute to go here. Offense lines up here. The Raiders take it from the 38. Cards off the mark there, incomplete. And the quarterback, the coaches, his teammates, everybody loves to see a player give that type of effort. How about the receiver just going all out to make the catch? Doesn't quite get there, but the effort is outstanding. Offense lines up here. 
The Raiders take it from the 38. Murray's handed the football. They'll have to rush now as he's taken down. Now on first down, every snap crucial the rest of the way. and five play action my goodness what a hit and the ball falls incomplete good job that time Jim by the defender he hit that receiver so hard that football came flying out that's why it's incomplete the big hit by the defender second down late in the fourth quarter Second down and five. Maurice Jones-Drew gets it here. Time is the huge factor as he's tackled, trailing. Every third down so big at this point. Stops the clock on the spike. Well, the quarterback has no choice here. The clock is running. You don't have time to really call a play and execute one down the field. So you get in formation, spike the football, and stop that clock. There are no timeouts left. But now the game is over. They've turned it over on downs. Give the defense a lot of credit. When the offense has four chances, Jim, it's really hard to stop them in these panic situations. But the defense came through. First down coming up. Here we go now. Hold up. Takes the knee. Second down coming up. Before we go, to take a beating like this, how do you come back from it? Well, you just forget it. Athletes are resilient. That's why you're at this level. Uh, you just let it go by the wayside. Don't think about it and just get ready for next week. game this truly was for Phil Sims, Danielle Bellini and Larry Ridley, Jim Nance saying